This program is brought to you by Emory University. Oh, Madagascar is just such a magical place. It's one of the oldest islands in the world. So it's been in its current location for millions and millions of years. And because of its isolation, it has very unique animals, very unique wildlife like lemurs. Lemurs are only found in Madagascar, nowhere else in the world. And people only arrived to the island of Madagascar about 2,000 years ago. So it was one of the last places to be inhabited by people. While Madagascar biologically is probably one of the richest places in the world, it is one of the poorest countries in the world. Um, poverty is a very, very big problem here, and diarrheal diseases and malaria in particular are two of the biggest killers of uh, people in Madagascar. Um, and they really affect children under the age of five. And so our team is here studying infectious diseases, especially diarrheal diseases and malaria, through a One Health approach to assess the ecology and infectious diseases of humans, wildlife, livestock, and the environment. And we're trying, trying to get a better picture, so instead of just going into households and seeing if people are sick and treating them, we want to understand the cause of these diseases uh, instead of just treating the symptoms. We're working with a nonprofit organization that is going to be coming in this year. They've actually done their initial reconnaissance, um, and they're going to be implementing a primary health care system in Madagascar. So we're very, very lucky. We have a wonderful team of extremely, like, exceptional students there. They really, really excel in their individual fields and with such a multidisciplinary team, we have a lot of really enriching conversations, even just at dinner time. <laughs> it's really, really interesting to sit in a room where, you know, a veterinarian and a nurse can talk about the same issue from very, very different perspectives. And it's great to have development students here too, because then we really start to, to discuss like what the implementation of a new NGO might be like for these communities. So while I study lemurs, you know, my perspective on, on the implementation of a healthcare system is very different from what a development student wants to see and sort of the needs assessments that they would like to see. It's, it's just really incredible. I think we're learning things from totally new perspectives and, and starting new discussions and really asking quest, new questions because because of this multi multidisciplinary approach. I think it's very important to address human health, of course, but um, we do have some of the world's most endangered animals in, in Madagascar and in these rainforests right back here. Um, we have some of the most endangered primates in the world, and when you have humans and, and lemurs coming into close contact, you have the potential for exchange of disease. So you have a lot of new emerging diseases in already critically endangered populations that could wipe them out forever. Um, and by taking a One Health approach, we're sort of addressing human health and conservation issues at the same time. It's not easy, but it's fun. I think everyone's enjoying it. It's very muddy. It's very, very, very muddy. I can't emphasize that enough. I don't think a single day goes by when every individual on the team did not fall in the mud. <laughs> so. The preceding program is copyrighted by Emory University.